What's going on guys? Josh here. I am joshrussell.com and I am back and I just want to teach you guys real quick a quick little lesson. Uh, the company Loom Cube, as you guys know, I just did the review. They sent me this awesome loom panel to try out. So what I want to do for you is I want to just take a few minutes and I want to set up my newer light, my flash, my studio strobe, whatever you want to call it, and compare it to just a straight up just LED constant panel light and see how they work. So I have Brooke here. She's going to model for me. And we're just gonna do a real quick run through of uh, in-studio portion, uh, in-studio setup, I should say, with the newer NW600BM, my studio light, and, uh, and then compared to a loom panel. So let's get right into it. I already have the newer, the studio strobe, like dialed in where I want it to be. Uh, so we're just gonna take some photos of, of Brooke with the studio strobe and see how they look. I'm going to show you the unedited while we're shooting this and then at the end of this video we'll go and we'll actually edit these photos and make them look Josh Russell like. So let's get into it. If this is your first time here and you do find this video informational and you learned something, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, the bell notification and leave me a comment. Let me know where you're from. I'd like to hear where you guys are from and what you're learning. So let's get into it here. All right. So I'm going to have you do that again. I'm going to have you turn your shoulder and then back to me, killing it. Let's put the hand up. Let's go. Uh, yeah, let's go with that one. And you don't have to be super formal. You can be a little bit more. There we go. Oh, yeah. Let's bring the head back just a little bit and bring the chin towards me. There we go. Boom. So I want you to I want you to do the same thing, but I want you to be a little bit more seductive with it. So so a little less uh, a little less uh, church teacher and a little more. Uh, Bad girl. Okay. There it is. Bring your head up just a little bit. Right there. Boom. Nailing it. Okay, so I'm going to have you do one more. I'm going to have you put your hand square straight up with me and then put your hands right like that. Bring your elbows in just a little bit. Uh, back. Sorry. Bring your elbows back. There we go. This is uh, the uh, Harley Quinn pose right here. So as you can see, I got a little bit of reflection. So I'm gonna bring this in just a little bit. So I, I'm getting a little bit of too much shadow on one side. So I'm just gonna bring that reflector in and see what I can do with that. So the same pose, elbows back just a little bit. There we go. There we go, looks so much better. Flash is not going off. There it goes, boom. Killing it. Let me go uh, just look at a couple of these here quick. Love it. Love it. I'm going to do one more. We're going to get nice and close and do one more. So I'm going to have you. Um, so what you're going to do is turn just a little bit and then bring your head back to me and bring your chin out. Kind of almost like that. like that. Go a little bit less of a smile, almost more like a. Just a, oh, just a slight open mouth. Squint the eyes just a little bit. Uh, less smile. <laughs> Boom. Okay. All right, so we got that shot. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull that light out. I'm gonna put the LED panel up and we're gonna see how it works compared to the two. So be right back. Okay, so now I have the loom panel set up. It's definitely less bright. Uh, so I had to change my settings. I was shooting at like one over 1000 on the studio strobe. I'm at like one over 200 now. I was shooting at ISO 50. Now I'm shooting at ISO 200, which is still pretty, pretty low. I suppose if you had like two of these, or if you had it set up a little different in a different studio, it would work. But I, I got it set and dialed in now, and it is at 5100 Kelvin, so it's a little on the cooler side as far as color temperature, and it is, it's at 100% strength. So keep that in mind when you're watching these shots. Uh, I still have the reflector right here. But yeah, so it is set completely different. It is definitely from even just setting it up in test shots. It's nowhere near as bright as the studio strobe, but I didn't expect it to be. I just want to see if this is usable for a studio type shot. If you're on the go or if you need to set up in a like a garage or a, a conference center or wherever you mean to set up and be able to shoot quickly. So let's try this out now. All right, so turn your head back that direction and then bring your eyes back to me. 
I definitely like the color of the light. Dang. Killing it. Maybe give me just a little bit of a smile. All right, back to no smile. Maybe that that evil look again. Boom. Bring your forehead up just a little bit. Wow. Love it. So it is that simple. Uh, the photos, they look awesome. I'm gonna try one more thing and this is gonna be like more for fun, but I'm gonna try one more thing and I wanna see how this turns out. So give me one minute and let me set up some something fun. Okay, so I told you I was going a little crazy. What I got is I got the, uh, the loom panel set up in the same spot as my main light. I have my Savage LED Light Painter Pro set up as a kicker a key light in the back and then for my fill I just have my reflector set up and that this right here is set up at like a hot pink color super bright but it's basically it's just creating some some light on the hair to create this nice uh pink slash purple glow in the background so let's just take a couple fun shots this is basically just for extra credit or whatever you want to call it I already got the shots that I want but since I have her here and she looks beautiful I'm going to take some awesome photos so let's go I'm gonna take you and have you turn your that way. Actually, you know what? Why don't you go all the way around and then bring come back over your shoulder at me? Like all the way. Like uh, nope, you were good. Come oh. back this way. Come back this way. Turn your shoulder this way. Turn your head back this way. There we go. Dang, girl! Woo! Just do that one more time. Wow. Let's go no smile. And so we'll take your head and just kind of shift it back towards me a little bit. So come back this way just a little bit. I know it's gonna be awkward, but. That's okay. Bring my eyes back to me. Can you take your shoulder that way more? No, other way? Oh, so you're almost like, oh, like okay. almost like straight up looking at, there we go. These are killer. Check that. Super in focus, super amazing. That's gonna do it. Now we're gonna head over to my computer and I'm gonna show you how to edit these. You can stop now if you wanna, if you wanna end your whole video uh, experience with me, that's great. Uh, so the lighting is fantastic. I'll tell you right now, this loom panel is pretty kick-ass. I, I do really like it. It's not super, super bright compared to like a studio strobe, but it's definitely, it'll work in a bind, especially if you had two or three of them and you could use like a, a fill, a key, a kicker, everything, and just have it all working together. One light, I really think it'll work as well. I think uh, it would work just basically just a straight down the line, awesome side shot light to do really artistic stuff. But once again, I approve of it, especially only at like $130 or whatever it is. Link is down in the description down below if you want to pick that up. I'll also put a link to my Savage Pro light painter down in the description down below. Once again, Brooke, thank you for hanging out with me. And uh, I'll check you over in the computer in a minute. All right, everyone. So I am done with that photo session. And here's what you need to do. If you want to see me edit these photos, what I do is a real deeper dive over on my Patreon page. What you need to do is you need to click on the link, the top link in the description down below, patreon.com forward slash I am Josh Russell and sign up for the monthly membership. It's super easy and it's, it's awesome. It's a great cause. It helps me make these videos and get more products and get more stuff like that. And it also helps you 
Just by signing up, you get four free preset packs for Lightroom, as well as all of the content to the Patreon. You're, you're going to get deep dive into editing. You're going to get behind the scenes views of sessions. You're going to get one-on-one -on -one sessions, video or in person, where I teach and help you. You also get discounts on my merch over at my merch store on IamJoshRussell.com. So once again, if you want to see how the photos were edited to complete and look like this one, all you have to do is go over and sign up on my Patreon page, patreon.com forward slash I am Josh Russell. It's super appreciative. All you're doing is basically buying me lunch once a month, and I will teach you everything that you want to know. Once again, go sign up, check out the edits. Thanks again, and I'll talk to you later. Peace.